I've been coming to Japan for many years, since 1991. And I've been working with New Japan since 1997, so to win the Intercontinental Championship last night was a, a, a great honor, a big, a big deal. I think I'm the only、uh, performer in history to be a WWE world champion,、uh, as well as,、uh, uh, sorry, a WWE intercontinental champion, as well as the IWGP intercontinental champion. So、um, it's very exciting and it's very、uh, important to the legacy of Chris Jericho. Um, and that's why I, I thought, you know, Naito lives in this bubble of, of New Japan and he's great. He's, he's, he's the best that New Japan has, but he only works in New Japan. Chris Jericho works around the world, and I have for 27, 28 years. So I just got tired of this little、uh, incessant insect buzzing. Bzzz, psh, shut up. Shut, shut the fuck up. Uh, was my idea. So that's why、uh, I was supposed to leave after the Tokyo Dome, but I decided to stay and go、uh, confront him at Corican Hall, which led to me attacking him in Fukuoka, which led to me beating him last night for the Intercontinental Championship. I think the difference between Naito and, and Chris Jericho is experience. And he was. Beating,、uh, beating me very badly at, at certain times in that match. And、uh, a couple times I couldn't see properly、uh, because my head was spinning and seeing、uh, stars.、Um, so that's why、uh, at the end of, of the fight, when he tried for the Destino, I was just like, fuck it. And I, I kicked him in the、uh, Kintama. To the nuts.、Uh, and that's experience. I turned the referee away so the referee couldn't see what I was doing. And I uh, did a very、um, low blow, a、uh, very dirty,、um, dirty tactics. But that's what makes Chris Jericho a winner. I know、um, sometimes when you have to do things that aren't legal, aren't honorable, Uh, but it doesn't matter because I got away with it and I win the Intercontinental Championship. So I think there was a real experience difference. I don't think Naito is smart enough to do something like that. Because、uh, when you're in a fight, everything,、uh, everything goes. And、um, it was a fight yesterday, and I won. Absolutely. I think Naito is an excellent、uh, opponent for me. I'm better. And that's okay. It's okay for Naito to lose to me、uh, because I am Chris Jericho and I have a lot of experience, like I said, and still at the top of my game. I mean, to win the Intercontinental Championship for the first time uh, uh, after coming to Japan since 1991,、uh, there's not a lot of. Uh, uh, performers that can say that. So I would, I would, I would wrestle with Naito again、uh, in a second. But、um, I also want to wrestle with Okada and Tanahashi. I want to challenge Kenny Omega for the IWGP Heavyweight Championship.、Uh, Evil needs to mind his own fucking business. I don't know why he came down last night. So、uh, there's a lot of、uh, opponents. In New Japan, that I would like to, to wrestle with. I'd like to get a tag team partner and wrestle against the Young Bucks. Well, Evil is,、um, when I look at the New Japan、uh, roster and see who are the next superstars of the company, the next Okada, the next Naito, the next Tanahashi, I think Evil is one of those、uh, candidates. But he made a big mistake、uh, coming down to save Naito. I know Naito is his friend, I know Naito is his、uh, senpai. But he needs to mind his own fucking business, you know? And、um, that really made me mad. But he's gonna pay the price, you know? I don't know when, 
but I hold grudges very deeply. Um, I don't forget and I don't live and let die. So I will get my revenge on evil at some point and only I know when. So congratulations, evil. You made a name for yourself. I didn't, I didn't know your name before, now I do. And now I can't think of anything else other than getting my, my revenge on evil. So watch out for that. And, and uh, it's going to happen. Like I said, New Japan is a, a great company, but it's, it's a very prestigious and it's a very difficult company to win a title. I mean, look how long it took for Kenny Omega to win the IWGP World Championship. Um, and for me to win the Intercontinental Championship, this is the first attempt. It's the first try for me. Um, but I'm not going to say like, oh, it's very easy for Chris Jericho, but another bit about bullshit. This is a very hard title to win. And it was very exciting for me last night to see Kenny Omega win the World Championship and Chris Jericho to win the Intercontinental Championship on the same night after we headlined the Tokyo Dome only four or five, six months ago, and both of us coming from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, which is a very small city uh, in, uh, in Canada. So, like I said, it's very exciting for me. It's just as important as the very first championship I won when I was 21 years old in Canada. And then I realized I really enjoy being here. You know, I like New Japan and there's a lot of, excuse me, there's a lot of great matches and possibilities for me here. Um, if I stayed in WWE, I've wrestled with everybody there. I love the WWE, but New Japan is uh, a brave new world, a whole new world of possibilities for me. And that's exciting um, and it's intriguing for me. So, that's one of the reasons why I came back to New Japan. It's one of the reasons why I wanted to be here. And now that I'm a champion here, um, I think there's a big future for, for, for Chris Jericho in New Japan. Um, and after all of these years, the reason why I still uh, wrestle, why I still uh, am involved in this business is because I enjoy it. I don't do it for money. I don't do it for prestige or for the cheers of the fans. I do it because I, I, I love what I do. Uh, as long as I can kind of um, be in control. And here in New Japan, it's a whole, like I said, it's a whole new chapter for the career of Chris Jericho. And I can see myself staying here for a long time. And New Japan is very, uh, is very um, uh, exciting right now because of the homegrown superstars uh, uh, exclusive to New Japan like Naito and Okada, uh, Tanahashi, Evil, uh, Sho and Yo, uh, uh, Hiromu, um, the Suzuki. It's very, very fun to watch, but there's also a lot of great. Um, I think Gaijing might be a bad word, but Gaijing talent from Kenny Omega, Young Bucks, Cody, Hangman Page, uh, Chris Jericho now with a very superstar element. So I think in the past, WWE was the most important wrestling company in the world. Uh, here uh, and now, I think New Japan has a lot of uh, momentum and nothing can beat WWE, but New Japan has a good chance of becoming very big in a worldwide basis because it does something different. It's not like the WWE. And that's exciting to me. That's why I'm here. I love WWE. I love working for Vince McMahon. But coming to New Japan is 
a completely different experience for me and uh, very exciting because of the superstars that are here and uh, the um, attitude of the company, the relationship with the fans. Uh, it's very refreshing for me to, to be here in New Japan. Uh, when I woke up in the morning, I had 78 texts. Um, and I only went to sleep maybe four or five hours ago. So just to see the reaction, I think a lot of people are starting to understand the appeal of New Japan, the excitement of New Japan. And um, I think that uh, it's exciting for people to see Chris Jericho here uh, in this company winning a championship. It opens the doors for more fans to watch because New Japan is not a Japanese company anymore. It's a worldwide company. Uh, the office, the new president, uh, all, the, all the guys uh, on the roster. So for me to win this title, it just makes New Japan more of a global company and not just a company that's performing in front of 13,000 people at the uh, Osaka Joe Hall, which is amazing, but for the you know, hundreds of thousands uh, and, and, and possibly millions of wrestling fans around the world that are now going to start watching New Japan because they know who Chris Jericho is and they think, oh, Jericho won the championship there? Maybe I will watch it more. You know, if you want some kind of a happy I love you message, you're not gonna get it from me. I don't care about fans. I don't care about the Japanese uh, uh, people that you know, watch Chris Jericho's matches and enjoy my matches. Um, all I care about is, is the Intercontinental Championship uh, and making um, making a real impact here in New Japan. And that's what I'm going to continue to do when I want, where I want, and how I want. And I think New Japan uh, is very, very, uh, um, very close to becoming a worldwide company and I'm one of the reasons why it's going to achieve that. So uh, congratulations, New Japan. Uh, you now have possibly the biggest star ever here in your company working for you. And that's a great honor for you. And it's a great honor for all of your fans.